Kamis. Keep going. Please do. Fly a plane into Mount Rushmore. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> what else would you like the weathermen to succeed at? You are a member of SDS, are you not? I am. Students of the Democratic Society. Yes. So uh, was SDS part of weathermen, or was the weathermen a breakout group? I'm a part of the we the weathermen faction. You are part yes. of the weathermen faction of SDS. <laughs> yes. I thought they were uh, defunct. So we, what we is is your leader and founder? Were, we used to be Revolutionary Youth Movement One. Okay. We are now the weathermen. <laughs> now, did you just take that name, or were you always part of the Weathermen under SDS? I was, I was a part of the Weathermen when they formed. No, you aren't. Yes, You're I was. Too old. Yes, yeah. I was. I'm too old. <laughs> <laughs> I, in fact, I wrote the weather statement that was so submitted you're, you're, at the convention. Your name is William Harrison, huh? Mo, my name is Jeffrey Jones. Bernadette Dorn. JG. <laughs> Bernardine. Bernadine, okay. Sorry. I'm not up by my uh, revolutionaries. <laughs> My, and my name's Bill Ayers. <laughs> what else would you like to see uh, bombed in America? Like? The White House. The White House. The White House. Before or after the Liberty Obama Bell. Electric? The Liberty Bell. Okay. <laughs> and the Alamo. Boom! <laughs> Dig deeper. The Grand Canyon! Fly a plane into the Grand Canyon! The USS Cole! <laughs> Too late! But do you support the terrorists who did that? So what do you think of the 17 sailors who killed in that murderous bat? You gotta crack eggs and make an omelet, right? <laughs> so they're just eggs. See you. <laughs> And you claim to support the troops, as long as they're not fighting any I wars. support the resistance in Iraq. Okay. I support the Mahdi Army. Okay. The Mahdi Army got its ass whooped. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see. al Sadr is hiding in Iraq, Iran right now. Because he's a fucking coward. Al-Qaeda is tailing ass out of Iraq because they're getting their ass whooped too. Not laughing anymore, are you? I just remember Vietnam so fondly. U.S. troops hightailing out of there. Thanks to people like you, huh? Nope. Thanks to the NLF. So how many people died in Vietnam? How many people were lost at sea? trying to flee from that communist government you guys support so much. Thanks to the press standing against the yoke of oppression. I support uh, it in any and all ways. So the people who were fleeing Vietnam for 20 years after the communist takeover were fleeing, fleeing uh, what? I support self-determination. I do not support him. Then why did people flee Vietnam in mass numbers? Thousands of them drowning at sea when their ships sank, overloaded ships sank. Why were millions killed while the United States was there? Why were millions killed while the French were there? Why were, why were they killed while the, Japanese, the French, the Japanese, and the United States all occupied? How come there was con consistent resistance at every stage of that involved, when that was involved? So you don't care about the boat people come, who died that lost rag, their lives? How come a ragtag group of third world revolutionaries, if they were nothing, if there was no popular support, how could they take on the Actually, strongest military in the world and nothing. win? And the U.S. was the strongest military in the world and they took him down. They took him down. Hey, George. Uh -huh. I was just passing all the message. She asked me to let you know. Yeah. Are you an anarchist, sir? Are you just hiding your face so you don't get identified? My name is Nestor Machno. I'm with the Ukrainian Armed Anarchist Forces. We're having a resurgence right now. Okay, I hope I got that. I don't know. There's a lot of traffic noise. You want to repeat it just in case, or you're fine? My name is Nestor Machno. I'm with the Ukrainian Armed Anarchist Forces. We're having a resurgence. Do you have a website? The bulk of the movement died off in about 1921.
but it's really coming back now, picking up steam. I think I actually read something about that the other day, but uh, do you guys have a website you'd like to announce? I, I actually, we don't have a website. We're kind of, we're still trying to update everything. It's a little bit antiquated. We're working back to info stuff? from 1917 is when it started. So. Okay. Were they involved with the Bolshevik Revolution too? Or um, they were actually fighting the Bolsheviks on one side, and um, we don't have that problem now. But there's still plenty of Reds out there, and they've never had our back, ever. So, hopefully this time, we are having to fight a war of two fronts against Bolsheviks and against the Tsar and Star. Well, I didn't think there were any Bolsheviks left, but I could be wrong. Maybe right. we'll win this time. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys. Great YouTube stuff.